Hi everybody. So I hope everybody's doing good. Let me close my closet. <laughs> Okay. Hi. Usually this time of day, I don't go live or do live stream, but I decided to do it this time. See um, what happens. So, oh. so um, and like usual, if I get disconnected or just buffering or something, you know, I'll, I'll be right back. Just be there and wait a little bit. Hi there. Welcome to stream. So, um, yeah, today I'm going to talk, uh, I mean, I'm just going to paint first <laughs> and talk about how black and how much black and white you see the world. Um, the reason because I was uh, listening to some, um, um, you know, speeches and. Sorry about the disconnection. I am here again. So uh, let me go to my. So, as I was saying, so, as I was saying, so, as I was saying, <laughs> okay, that was weird. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, so most of the people in the world actually see the world really black and white. Um, and if you really wanted to uh, see how you see the world, uh, or how you, you know, I mean, pay attention to around you or whatever. Um, I think you can measure how angry you are all the time. I mean, anger is something we all experience it every day. And, uh, you know, less or more, it doesn't matter. Uh, it was, um, um, I was listening to a doctor which was saying um, some people actually experience anger uh, like 2,000 times a day. It's pretty much, I mean, it's a lot. I don't know how, <laughs> so, but yeah, I guess it happens. So um, yeah, I just wanted to paint something. And if you come into this uh, live video, we can chat about it. So yeah, so this is the canvas I'm gonna uh, paint on. This is um, six by six inches. And, uh, and the width, I mean, the thickness of it is an inch, I think. Yeah, yeah, has to be. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to use ac uh, acrylic paint. Uh, I have uh, some paint here in my palette. Mm, let me show you here. Yeah, I have a tray here. So, because I want to use uh, water and, uh, I don't know, mix my colors in my palette. Uh, so I'm using this big tray. These are really cheap. I bought them from dollar store. So it's are like a dollar. And um, yeah. So, uh, so you can use any color you want. Whatever. It uh, doesn't matter. But uh, yeah. So I was. Uh, so I'm going to put it on the uh, canvas here. And then we start talking. I guess. Um, here you go. Okay, so sorry, trying to make it work. I dropped the microphone. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's drop this down a little bit so I have some room. Here we go. All right, so, all right, so I'm going to paint something, just something comes to my mind in this topic, and I hope you guys like it. Yeah, it's been a while, I, um, 
having that, you know, been live, I mean, doing live stream, live video, uh, because, uh, well, I've never told you uh, or I mentioned it in my videos, but uh, I'm pregnant. Yeah, I'm really happy. <laughs> and uh, it's not like, you know, it was before. So I'm a little bit, you know, um, you know, just get tired sometimes and I cannot be as active I was before so I hope you understand that uh, but yeah everything is good and uh, so just to actually have really good pregnancy though I'm not complaining about anything but just you know wanted to mention it, it why I really <laughs> not really active like I was before I usually had you know live listening every day but um, Thursday, now I'm pregnant, I can't do that, you know, because I get tired <laughs> um, faster than before, so that's the reason. Uh, so as you see, I'm uh, mixing my colors, this the color I used here for blue is, uh, I think it's... Let me look. I'm not sure. Yeah, okay. So this blue is Admiral Blue. Um, really, really close to navy blue. Uh, a little bit blue, more bluer, you know, more brighter than... Um, navy blue and the yellow I'm using is yellow or craft so um, just going uh, for the background with one inch round head uh, paintbrush I'm not really um, making any I don't I don't add much water in my paint but I use uh, mix my uh, paint a lot on the canvas so it's why it's look really transparent so yeah so as you see here hello hi there welcome to stream uh, yeah so uh, Just doing the background now. You know, um, when I, you know, uh, want to talk about something or something really uh, make my mind, uh, I don't know how to say it. Wait a second, let me think about it. Like I want to talk about something or uh, something kind of... Um, in my mind in the end uh, and just trying to make sense of it you know I always you know uh, look over myself first you know I don't really uh, I'm not that kind of person to judge people or compare people to others unless they wanted to be uh, why are you planning to paint yeah I want to uh, paint something um, about you know you know as a topic I put how much black and white you see the wall but I'm not using black and white now because this is the background uh, well I'm painting uh, something um, um, you know in that topic uh, so just uh, bear with me I'm I'm gonna explain exactly what um, I was thinking about the face, um, but I'm not sure. You know, I usually when I paint something, especially when I'm doing live stream, I change my mind over and over and over. <laughs> so, I uh, don't know. But yeah, I was thinking about that topic because it's really, really, um, you know, I usually think I am a person that um, don't see world black and white at all. You know, I... 
um, really uh, hi there hi Molly welcome to stream I see there were like you know there are goods there are bads and but most of the world is um, you know different you know we are different people so uh, but um, to me uh, mm, majority of people majority of us um, or some point in our life or whatever you know we see the world really black and white um, like when you are in the situations you know different situations uh, so I mean I'm not gonna say I've never seen the world black and white but yeah I even did that too I think when you are uh, angry you will see how much you you will notice how much you see the world black and white I mean everybody's you know has anger I mean uh, so we cannot say oh I'm not an angry pe person you know yeah I'm you know I'm not an angry person but we experience anger <laughs> make you know be a little bit weird I'm talking about that stuff but it's true you know we all experience anger you know uh, but how we express that anger uh, is the way well you know you can tell if you see the word black and white like I was uh, thinking about myself um, so I usually when I'm angry at something or somebody um, you know it can be just like I mean, you watch a movie and just the story of the movie make you kind of like feel like, what was that, you know? I mean, the way you show your, your anger, I think, makes you angry person or a reasonable person. So, like me, I usually don't get angry with people or at you know, stuff, you know, just, sorry about that, a little bit of disconnection, but I'm back, but I was saying, you know, I usually don't get angry with people, or, I mean, if they do something, or say something, kind of make me that feeling of uneasiness, I usually tell them, Unless, um, unless, you know, I don't really don't know them or they're not, you know, in a place or not in a place or I am not in a place to, uh, say it. So I think, um, that's why I'm, but if you are the person that would, you know, get mad or angry of people and you just say it. Um, or you get you want to fight them I think that that means you really see the work black and white because you have that mentality of mm, you have to make the situation better you know <laughs> uh, with you know something you have to do something I mean um, maybe it's why a lot of the people I see or you may say something bad, you know, to them, you know, say something like, um, I mean, cuss words or whatever, <laughs> whatever, you know, or just, you know, go talk bad behind their back. Or, I mean, you know what I mean? Just um, um, <laughs> try calligraphy. Yeah, I did. I actually really like calligraphy. It's, um, ah, it's. Pretty, uh, I mean, has a lot of variety of doing, you know, especially when I was in college, you know, I, I had a, I was a roommate with a girl. She was in graphic. She was uh, her, she, what she was studying was graphic. So a lot of her um, work she was, she had to do for school. Actually, I did it for her because I think I was, I liked it better than her. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I really like it. So I think from your name, you you must do that, you know, or you have a channel doing that. Hmm. 
So, yeah. So I'm going to get a paintbrush. A little bit smaller. A little bit now, more smaller. So it's, this is number seven. Blurry. Okay, this is number seven. But um, okay. And I'm gonna use this for so it's still pretty wet, but not that bad. So we have a background now. So we know our paint gonna lay on the canvas much better now. So I'm gonna use, ah, I'm hitting everything. What is wrong with me? So I'm gonna use black color. Okay, good, thank you. <laughs> um, and So uh, usually when I want to paint like portrait or a face, something like that, for meaning, I usually use my own face. <laughs> like, um, um, so right now, I was thinking to, to show this, you know, I thought you were using black. Yeah, I mean, I'm not using black. Uh, like, I mean, not that really, really deep black, but I usually make my black, you know, uh, mix it with colors. So, yeah, I'm gonna use black. I mean, darkness and lightness. But the whole meaning is um, I wanna show I mean, if you just see everything black and white, it's, it's not a really beautiful place, you know. That's why the people who usually see black and white, you know, around them, they're really, really angry per people, you know. So <laughs> I think um, to show that in a painting, uh, it's good to show it in a portrait or maybe, I, I don't know, anything can, you know, be, can even show it in, show it with, I mean, landscape, you know, or... I mean, it's still life. You can do it, you know, any ways you want. But I was thinking to um, show half a face, uh, you know, kind of black and white, and half a face more like, you know, normal color of a person. <laughs> but yeah, uh, but yeah, I'm the black I'm using um, is I'm actually. You know, uh, doing all my paintings, mix all my painting, paints together, and I come up with kind of more brownish, actually, uh, black. Let me see how it comes out. So a little bit of red and uh, blue. And I'm going to mix these, maybe purple. And more blue. But yeah, so more purplish color. So I'm gonna go here. Yeah, I was saying, I usually use my own face when I wanna do a portrait. I just, um, you know, for face, you know, you wanna go face, you usually go, um, you know, measure. So if you wanna just paint something like that, so you, oh, better, my, my computer makes noise, sorry about that. So I'm gonna just, okay. All right, 
So I'll mute that now. Yeah. It's a headline. Because this is a small canvas, I have to make sure I have all my I just I'm not gonna go really deep because I wanna have a room for everything. So Eyes. Mm -hmm. Lips. One of the things that you know when you want to do portrait, especially from your own face, always pay attention to the size of everything in your face. Usually, I see a lot of mistakes people do in doing portraits is they usually paint their lips really, really small. <laughs> they paint it like, I mean, we have, you know, uh, abnormality in some faces, but usually your lips are bigger than your, uh, your eyes, so pay attention to that. So... And so if your eyes here, and I'm not going to make it really, really realistic painting, though, I'm just trying to make it face here and then go over the colors I want to use. Anyways. So. Okay, so I have now if something like face, you know. Now I'm gonna go with the colors. So I was saying, yeah, um, I think uh, to see if you see the world really black and white, you need to pay attention in your. Um, In your life and see how much of I'm just putting like dots to get the lights and Darkness right here. And When you see everything really bad, I mean, some people don't have any 
um, I guess any like we, we can say difference I guess or um, boundary for for life their life I'm just looking at my see this is the mirror I use so I'm just looking at myself and doing this um, just to it's not looking like me but I'm trying to you know when you have a face you know better you know can better shape whatever you're painting so I always you know use my own face if I want to and change it to different person always helped so I don't know probably gonna help you too But yeah, so. And when you see everybody bad or good and you don't have anything between you you must see the world more black and white not much color I mean you can still you know help yourself sometimes in life we do that you know just I mean, in different situations, you know, you get mad or angry of somebody and you go towards that. So it's not something like, so now, so because I'm gonna, so as you see that uh, the black I made is more purplish. I think I need a darker um, green to add to it. I'm gonna go find my darker green. It's not here by my side. First green. Let me find out what I had. I'm cleaning up around because I want to bring everything in this room. Uh, my artist stuff. Um, the baby's in the on the way, and you know I have to clean up and make room for my own stuff and for the baby so okay 
I don't know. And not a little bit grayish. It's not super black, but better than, I mean, just. So it has to be here, there. Of course, I'm going to use a lot of white to make different gray. So, just wanted to show you the difference between it. And it's the easiest way you can do. So, two different colors. That is true. Life is more than what we think. You know. Day you decide to stop judging people, you know, just because you don't like him for whatever reason, you're gonna see the world a better place. I'm not joking, it's true. Hi, Eve. How are you? Thank you for being here. Oh. It doesn't look like me though. <laughs> but duh. Painting on myself. Love your channel. Thank you. I love your channel too. It's been a while. Uh, every time you go live, I'm not home to watch you. I see you, uh, you know, on your my notification. But I, I really like to come to your live and watch it. You're doing really good. So. Not gonna make you know a lot of hair or whatever. I'm just gonna put this as something to attach something else. Oh. So now I'm gonna go with the just black and white. Yeah, I was saying um, to many different people who are here, I was talking to them. I think they left, uh, but 
just thinking about how different every, everybody is. We really see that. We don't go black and white on everything and everybody, <laughs> you know. We love more, I guess, if we... Pay attention to these small little little details. But yeah, so we need to stop judging each other. We do that. Because, you know, I think when you see black and white, everything really bad, you start hating people. And when you hate people, um, you start, you know, doing bad stuff. You know, you punish people, you punish yourself. You always, you know, busy with this stuff on, you know, instead of enjoying your life, you know, I... I notice, you know, people are really, really busy doing, you know, talking about other people are really, really unhappy people because um, they see the world like that and it's bad, but what can you do? I'm going to go to the other side and work on the other side a little bit more. A bit more, you know, actual human face color, <laughs> like a skin color. So. Yeah, 
I usually don't get live in this time of day, but I decided to do it today. Actually, pretty good. Mm -hmm. Very good today. Why not just sit down without hurting my back? Looks like I did it with a palette, by the way, I didn't. Now, oops, not that good. too much. So, what I'm going to do for this side is challenging. Bright colors. And beautiful. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. like it. I think I got my point. You know. I think I did.
through. So when you see your own mistake, it's pretty cool in painting, especially in your, you know in uh, in a portrait. Uh, you need to be able to see your own mistake. Like here now, I notice that this eye is going down, and this eye is up. The reason. Because when you use you know colors, especially colors for skin, if you're painting a portrait, you see better you know the details. So that's why you don't you have less you know mistakes. A lot of people think you know painting with colors actually is harder, it is not. And uh, sorry, I'm making the mistake, you know. Maybe, uh, anyways. So let me. Get in there, in there. You can tell just like that face, this side has a spirit in it. This one doesn't. You know? Seriously. Looks dead. Solid. You know? Still. This one now has life in it. There's movement. You know, when I, when I like a painting that I'm doing, and I, kn I don't want to change it much, but I know I have a mistake here and there, so I just play around with it. Right now, I'm really, really happy with this painting. I'm just playing around to 
to find the right you know balance in the colors and whatever movement so I don't want to destroy whatever I made so I always pay attention what I'm doing and yeah. So I just used, so I'm going to use a smaller brush just make my eyes I really don't care about it though but make my eyes pop better okay and after that I'm gonna sign and be done see yeah okay so this is number three using so totally of the paintbrushes I used for this painting was this number seven number um, half an inch flat brush this one and this one inch uh, I thought it was one inch actually three quarter of an inch flat brush with moon moon shape head so four paint brushes and i'm going to use this one number three now so not bad and it took me let's see it took me i don't know what time is it 12 18 yeah around an hour and a half not bad reasonable I talk a lot in it too. So. Here we go. I'm gonna put a dot here. This one. Inch. Inch one. I think that's it. I'm gonna sign it. I'm gonna sign it with red. Red in the black side. Black and white side. Yeah. 
So, hope you enjoyed this painting. Let me know what you think. And what is your idea of black and white world? And what do you see in world and people? I really enjoyed this painting. I hope you guys enjoyed it too. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. If you are new here, uh, don't forget to subscribe, share and like this video. Alright, so... Hey, here is me. <laughs> oh, it's good. I don't know. Does it look like me? It does a little bit though. Because I was looking uh, a little bit younger. <laughs> me, younger. <laughs> but yeah, it's so just uh, to an idea. I mean, I hope you like it. And um, i see you in my next video. Hopefully, uh, I don't know. Tomorrow, maybe. If I feel good like today again, I'll be right back and do it. So, yeah. Um, the colors I used, it was um, red. It was just uh, uh, original, what is it, basic, basic red, base red. So the first red you get. Uh, I got used pink, which is the same red with a lot of white, so not half half. Uh, one part uh, red, three part white, so that's my pink. The blue was an uh, admiral blue, and I used yellow okra. I used um, um, green. The green I used is. Um, the first green with a lot of white, so first green is the, you know, half and half um, blue and uh, yellow, and uh, that's your first green. And after that, this green, I, I add to it one part the green, one part yellow, and two part uh, white, and that's the green I got. So, all right. And for the white, it's just titanium white. For the black I made, it's not really black. It's, I used, I actually add uh, red and blue and my green into it, a little bit of yellow, uh, which it was not really good idea. <laughs> so uh, just mix your paint together, see if you can uh, get the black you want. Uh, but if you can't, just use black paint whatever um yeah that was it and i hope you enjoyed this painting and this video um all right let me know what you think in the comment section below and i see you in next time bye